What's going on guys? So welcome back. We just got back to the shop. Uh, we unloaded all these bags, uh, drove back home Saturday night, had a little break Sunday, and then now we're back here Monday. Did a little final count of everything we bought. It was around 85 pairs all here. Um, Seattle was like 160, so half. I don't know. I just felt like senior con, I was able to get down to business kind of a little more quickly, I should say. And then uh, got sold was, it was cool. It's just a little more, uh, people are there for show it seems like opinion but hey i'll do it again if it comes around but i definitely like sneaker con better just my opinion 85 pairs we got some pretty good stuff got a bunch of uh born and raised one pair of chunky two pair of chunkies phantoms we got three pairs of mummies all this some tiffany air forces a bunch of random dunks uh lightning fours we actually completely sold out recently so i needed to re-up on those if you got pairs for sale hit us up cactus every time we get them they're gone the fleas so i had to re-up on those i bought the only three pairs i saw in the building i'm on my to try buying everything in the building pretty much what i got the only ones that were left were this crazy price and then yeah a bunch of other random stuff i got a bunch of zions like seven pairs of zion one lows those will be added unfortunately by the time this video goes up, most of the stuff's probably gonna be gone already, so I apologize. With that being said though, make sure you guys follow us on Instagram, turn the notifications on, all that good stuff. Everything we post daily gets put on our story, and it usually goes pretty quick, so make sure to follow us on there. Everything we post goes up daily. One cool steal, in my opinion, it's a steal, but brand new. Got these out there for 350, so I don't know what I'm gonna put them at, but nothing really on the market in that size, so we'll see. But that was a cool little steal. Um, as far as old stuff, Again, I feel like SneakerCon is better when it comes to old stuff. There wasn't really much old stuff out there. It was all pretty cookie cutter when it comes to all the new stuff. Today's been a pop day, non-stop. Might need to not buy for the rest of the week because it's a little overwhelming. I'm not gonna be here this weekend. I'll be in LA doing fun stuff. Out of here. So, that means we gotta add everything before I leave. Cause Chewy's not gonna do it. T's not gonna do it. That's all me. What's up guys? We have a size 10 and a half here. Beautiful shoe. <laughs> what are we gonna do for this? It's 400 right now, let's see. Let's see how Kevin takes care of me. Is it for you or is it? It's for me. Yeah. 250. <laughs> 260. Wait, actually, um, I have store credit with you. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna apply it to this. How about the, all the other shoes you got in the back? What other shoes? One second. I have shoes in the back. Oh, here you go. That's for our, your store credit. Wait. Yeah, can I just get cash? <laughs> I'll spend it with you eventually. <laughs> Dude, it's I wanted I wanted the package deal originally. Uh, now I gotta re-add this. It was already added. Fine. Let me, I, I passed up on sales for you. Wait, let me see this. This is why I don't do holds. What's, what's the next uh, show we're going to? Uh, I heard we're going to Hawaii. I don't know. Is that is that confirmed? So Hawaii. It's like a month from now. A month from now. A little longer. If somebody comments, at least one comment saying that we need to go to Hawaii, then we have to do it. Yeah. Just one? Just one. Because we need to make that person's dream come true. You're right. To go to Hawaii. Hey, one comment. Here we go. One comment. You heard it here first. Can I try these on? Yeah. Yeah. Saturday here at the Fix and the Pop Plug. We got a little sale going on for pops. A lot of people coming in selling stuff. Uh, buy out here, buy out over there. Another guy waiting for a price. We got Alex buying shoes. It's going down.
customer came in to sell their sneaker collection. We asked him why he was selling his pairs. And this is what he said. The reason I'm selling my shoes I'm trying to liquidate because I'm trying to pay my credit card bills, man. It's getting out of hand, so we're going to man up sometimes, man, you know. We got hobbies, but you know, we got bills we got to pay, man, so that's, that's all we got to do. Today was a day, but we got rid of some pops, made some sales. We're closing. Today was a busy day, really busy. Really busy. Bro, this shit is tiring for real. But I had fun, you know. I love prime people. Thoughts on today is probably the longest day ever. But shout out to Papa. Because, uh, great sales we got. Bro, stop recording. Today was the most stressful day of my life. Um, I say this every week, man. It was the worst day of my life. Um, when you have a lot of people who don't know anything about Pops. Only person to fall on his tea. <laughs> <laughs> bro, we look like we're on some ghost adventures up here. I know, bro. All right, so a customer came in today and dropped off some Stanford player exclusives. He was part of the coaching staff. Um, and recently, the coach got let go, so the whole staff got let go. Um, Matt dropped that knowledge on me. I had no idea. That's how it worked. He dropped off some Nike uh, Stanford PEs. So this one's called the Hustle. Kind of cool. It's like a cool ball shoe. Got the Stanford logo there just on that side these are all promo tagged as well like uh basically samples or player exclusives it's the kd stanford one another kd stanford logo and then the new sabrinas new sabrina this is actually pretty sick like, i would ball on this one it's pretty tight the kds are cool too I actually like that one. That one, and then the all red pair, Stanford logo. So that's pretty sick. This kind of stuff doesn't really walk in every day. I probably wouldn't usually buy it, but I got it for a good price, so I'll try to sell it for a good price. Maybe I'll keep some. You ball? You know, let's just say, uh, yeah, I used to. Old now and fat, so. Don't let him fool you, he won the Portugal tournament. I did win the Portugal tournament in the Azores. Damn. I did win that, so. You know what I'm saying? And that was like two years ago. There's another one just came out recently. Pretty dope. Uh, the new Adidas Ninja Turtle Shell Toes. So, like toy packaging, kind of how the Bapes do it as well, or the Bape does it, I should say. That slides out. The quality is crazy on them. It's actually really nice. And the thing I saw too about these is there's a bunch of different laces. So all these laces. And then there's a bunch of different lace locks. So like it has all the different first letter of their names. So that's pretty cool. The coolest thing I saw that we don't really get this with Nike. But double sided insole, that's some crazy detail stuff. Nike kind of skimps out on that sometimes. So it's pretty cool to see. I personally probably wouldn't wear them. I'd probably collect them and just like hang them in my room or something like that. It's kind of dope. I don't know. What do you think? You're Adidas guy. You play soccer, right? Mm -hmm. They're cool, they're different. I yeah. like how this is like a, a shell. Yeah. You What'd know you... why? They're shell toes. Ah, shell oh. toe. Shell toe. <laughs> shell toe. Would you break dance in these? Heck yeah. Yeah, hell yeah. All right, man. <laughs> Cowabunga, bro. All right, guys. So I took Victor's job and I'm taking pictures. And um, we just bought some nice Travis Scott's. And um, they're $899. So. Size six and a half, so if you come in, you should totally buy these. Oh, I'm supposed to talk? Right now? What? What do you want from me? Right now I'm uh, shipping out pops. That's, awesome. That's it. Just sitting down, shipping out pops. Um, why don't you go see what Victor's doing right now? <laughs> that guy loves to be on camera. No means no. Go get Chewy. Go get Chewy. Yes, David. <laughs> so here we are in the uh, the pop uh, back room area, just putting all the new stuff we add back into the shelves. Real exciting stuff. My favorite Funko Pop would be the uh, Ralphie in the bunny suit from A Christmas Story. Bing!
We got Minnie Mouse Diamond. Disney's over here. Real exciting stuff. All right, happy Friday, everybody. Happy Friday. Um, tomorrow is not Easter, tomorrow's Saturday. Sunday's Easter. But David brought up an idea to us about doing like an Easter egg hunt type thing because I guess he had a bunch of free eggs. Oh, you can ask him if you guys want. But he has a bunch of free eggs. Um, so we're going to do like a sale uh, tomorrow in store that we're going to announce on Instagram today. Basically, it's going to be like a basket of eggs. You pick an egg and there'll be a surprise in there. So it could be 10% off, 20% off. Uh, it could be a chocolate. And one of chocolate, or it could be something else, something cooler. I'm not gonna say it here. You just gotta come in and see what's going on. Uh, and then we'll recap everything, and that'll be in the next video. So tomorrow we're gonna be doing that. That should be pretty fun. And then uh, other exciting announcement: next hunt and none is April 20th, 420. Everyone's favorite day, I guess. Um, 420, hunt and none, and uh, I'm gonna show you guys a sneak peek. Just one shoe. Just one shoe. That's all you guys need for now. I think everyone knows probably what this is. Off white fours. Hundred bucks. Four twenty. The one and only. Hundred none. Often imitated. Never duplicated. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Four twenty. See you guys there. And uh, yeah, I appreciate everybody for watching. That's probably it for this week. See everybody next week. Go comment, subscribe, like, all that good stuff. Please, please, please. We appreciate everybody's support. And uh, 